Jester Tester, an honest review for you. Hello everyone, Jester Tester is back with another review. This time we are reviewing the ODRVM Wi-Fi Action Camera. Now this waterproof camera gives incredible 1080p visuals in a compact, lightweight, on-the-go action camera. So let's have a look at it. Here it is, guys. It comes in a very nice travel case. Uh, it's a zip-up case. It's a sturdy, well-made case. Um, it's not a hard case. It is semi-soft, but it is backed up with a type of plastic or, or some kind of backing in it, which makes it sturdy. All right, it is covered in great neoprene. All right, making it um, waterproof and dirt-proof. Uh, it has a nice handle on it. Um, it really, really is a great, great case. Um, which brings me to another point. This is probably one of the best um, deals that we've had uh, for quite some time now uh, as far as everything that you get with this whole package. So let's get into it and let's take a look at it, all right? Uh, we'll open it up. Like I said, the case alone, if you look at the case, the thickness of this case and the way it's made, um, you have your, your uh, netting in the back to hold all your items and the uh, foam, the thickness of the foam, everything. It's just great. I, I, I like it a lot. All right, so I'm going to kind of move through this review kind of quick because there's a lot to get in in a short period of time. So bear with me, guys. All right, so I'm going to move a little fast on this. Um, first off, what you get in here is just an incredible amount of gear for uh, an incredible price, to be totally honest with you. Um, you get a plethora of mounts. Uh, I'm not gonna get into uh, every single mount that's in here. Uh, if, if anybody has a GoPro camera, action camera, or anything like that, you kind of get the idea what these mounts do. Uh, this one hooks up to uh, uh, tripods, things like that, all different kinds of mounts. You have uh, uh, swivel mounts, your bike mount, your handlebar uh, bike mounts. Uh, you have the mounts with 3M, so you can uh, stick it to uh, car dashboards, more swivel mounts, things like that. Uh, again, more mounts. The mounts in here is uh, another uh, great thing, which is another good point when you think about it. If you go, if you, anybody with GoPros or anything like that, just the mounts alone, if you wanted to go get a set or a, uh, a kit of mounts, you know they go around anyway. You can pick them up from $20 to $30, $40. I mean, so that alone, without even the camera, makes this a great deal. So you get the mounts plus this case. And if you wanted to get a case for your for your camera, you know how much cases go, especially a good case. So right there, the deal is, is great to begin with. All right, so let's continue. Uh, more 3M uh, sticky pad mounts. You get tie-down cables. Um, this is another great part, too. You get an extra backing for your uh, waterproof case, which is great. They give you another one of those. I mean, the, the amount of gear they give you is just... I'm, I'm so impressed by it. Uh, zip ties. More swivel mounts. Uh, let's see. Uh, Velcro. Uh, of course, your manual. Oh, and another thing that's great, too. More mounts. The mounts just keep coming. It's like an endless well. Uh, what do you call that? Uh, clean cloth. Uh, oh, yeah. And here's the other good part, too. They give you two lithium batteries, which is a great thing, too. I mean, you get two lithium batteries with this setup. So that makes that great. All right, so let's get into the camera. All right. So this is the camera. It comes in a waterproof case. All right. The case is great. I love the case on this. It's, it's very, very thick, hard acrylic. All right. Very, very sturdy. It also comes with another mount on it already. Um, <clears throat> the buttons on it are very nicely spring-loaded to um, press the, the uh, internal buttons on the camera. All right. Uh, the way this opens is if you can see it up there you have to press this button here to the side and then lift the front of this up it takes a little bit of um finger work but it's not too bad there you go you just lift that up then you lift the back plate up and that'll open this up okay and then this sits in there pretty good it's pretty tight all right so like i said um the case i'm really i'm really surprised by the uh the thickness of this acrylic it's really really nice the gasket around here seals very very well 
All right, it is uh, very waterproof. One thing to remember, when the camera goes into this case, it muffles the microphone in the camera just a bit. Um, well, quite a bit, I should say. So you don't really get the um, sound quality out of it. But, <clears throat> of course, if you're underwater, you're not going to be talking anyway. At least I hope you're not. You won't be for a while. You won't be for long if you are. Um, uh, so <clears throat> that's the deal with that. All right, so let's put that aside. Let's take a look at the camera. Um, if I cut out on you, it's because I, I've got a bad cough and I don't want to cough on camera. So if, if the camera cuts in and out, you'll know what I'm doing. Um, so if, uh, if that happens, I'm sorry about that, guys. All right, so let's take a look at the camera. On the camera, you see you got your wide angle lens. All right. You have your power button in the front. All right. On the sides, you have your, well, in the front here, you have your uh, speaker, your microphones on the side. Okay, you have your up and down buttons which cycle through menus, things like that. <clears throat> you have an OK button on the top, which is also your shutter button for your camera. All right, you have an LCD screen on the back. Okay, you have your ports on the side, your HDMI and your USB. You also have your memory card slot right there. All right, I'm using a 32 gigabyte uh, card which I would recommend because you want to get your um, the best, uh, the longest amount of uh, record time out of this. It does record in 1080 uh, progressive, 1080p. Um, it is Wi-Fi enabled also, which I'm not going to get really uh, um, that much into that because like I said, I could spend another 45 minutes on just the features of this alone. But basically, the Wi-Fi <clears throat> enables you to hook this up to your iPhone or to your Android device, and you're able to use your phone as um, <clears throat> the camera lens, so you're able to see, the, you're able to point the camera somewhere else and actually control, record, and playback functions on your uh, um, iPhone or your Android, which is kind of cool. But one thing to remember, um, that only goes, you can only be about maybe 10 to 15 feet um, away from your uh, Android device or your iPhone with this when you connect. So you can't go too far away from it. Um, so that's the thing with that. All right, so let's turn it on and take a look at it and see what, uh, what we got here. You hit the button in the front. That's your power button. All right, it'll power on. Okay. And... I'm just going to cycle through right now. If you if you click the button, you're in video mode. It automatically goes into 1080 10, uh, 1080p. All right. If you click it again, it'll go into your camera mode. So now you're in camera mode. If you want to take snapshots, you just hit the top button. All right. If you click it again, all right. It'll go into your setup modes. Now again, <clears throat> to save time, I'm not going to go into every single. Um, mode that this has all right but i'm just going to cycle through them so you can see them real quick um resolution tv out osd mode time lapse record capture mode cyclic record hdr motion detection audio date stamping image size quality and you have your sharpness your white balance your color your iso your exposure and your anti-shaking which for me guys i use that a lot <clears throat> to be honest with you um your language, your date time, your auto power off, your beep sound, if you want to turn that beep on and off, your TV modes, your screen savers, your frequency, your rotate, car mode, your Wi-Fi SSID, your Wi-Fi password, your license no set, your delete, which you want to delete your photos and your videos, whatever, your formats, your default settings, and your version of it. Um, now, for a camera like this, that's got to be the most settings I've ever seen in a camera. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, and like I said, um, hang on one second, I'll be right back. All right, sorry about that, everyone. Again, like I said, I got this bad cough, and I got to keep... Um, cutting out on you and um well anyway so like i was saying it does have a wi-fi mode all right and the way you uh get into that you have to get out of your setting all right um let's see and if you hit the top sometimes it's a little difficult to get into the wi-fi setting oh i shut it off all right 
So if you just click once, you'll go into your Wi-Fi setting. And like I said, they have an app for it. Um, and once you pair it up with your uh, iPhone or your Android, it will pair up with it. You can use your iPhone or Android as the viewfinder for the phone. Um, it's a cool feature. Like I said, you can't go too far with it. Um, about that's around 10 15 feet so that's the base overview of the camera guys uh let's take a look at some of the video uh that uh, i shot with it it's just going to be some quick videos just so you get an idea of the look of, uh, of it i'm not going to go into too uh, long of it's just going to be parts and pieces of video just so you can get uh, an idea of the quality of the video and then we'll come back into the review room and we'll wrap this up all right guys let's take a look All right, guys, we're back. And as you can see, that takes some really, really great video. I'm really, really impressed with this. Um, it is a remarkable buy for the money. It's probably one of the best deals in electronics and gear that we've found to date. So grab yourselves one. Uh, you definitely can't go wrong with it. All right, just a tester saying be well, guys. Happy shopping. And until the next review, we will see you.